Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Smiley, coming at you guys with another 5M tutorial. In today's video, we're just going to be going over how to install a loading screen onto your guys' 5M server. This video is requested by the person here on screen. If you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, video request ideas, put them down in the comments below. I try to get to every single comment, but with all that being said, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Alrighty, so for the first order of business, what we're going to do is head over to Chrome. I am going to leave a link in the description below for this website. This website is a very, very nice tool for creating a basic loading screen. There is a free and pro version. The free version is a hands down more than capable, so we're going to be using that in the video. So I already created my loading screen. It's pretty self-explanatory, so I'm not going to include it in the video. But what we are going to do is we're going to hit this install on your server button here. From there, it's just going to open up your WinRAR or 7-zip, whichever program you have installed. From there, you're going to want to navigate to your TX data folder. This is the folder that you installed when you created the server. You're going to want to navigate to your resources folder. Mine's a little bit different. I use the ESX legacy framework. All the steps should be pretty much the same. Just find that resources folder. And from there, you're going to want to drag the compressed file into the resources folder. Hey everybody, Future Smiley here. So I did make a minor error while recording that video. You're not going to want to drag the compressed folder into the resources folder. You're going to want to extract to. You can do that by hitting this extract to button and navigating to where the file is located. Or you can click and drag the file and drag that to the resources folder. I would recommend changing the name of it just to kind of make it stand out a little bit easier. So once we've dragged that file into the resources folder, what we're going to want to do is head over to our server config and then scroll down to the default and set alone resources portion. From there, you're going to want to type in ensure and then the exact name of the folder that holds your loading screen. This is case sensitive, so I do recommend copying and pasting if you are having some difficulties. But once you're done with that, you're going to want to hit Control S for saving and then go ahead and minimize after, out of that. We're going to head over to TX Admin on Chrome for the last time. Here, we're just going to navigate to the Resources tab. Click Reload and Refresh. From there, you're just going to scroll down to the Root section here. You should see the new resource pop up. If you see a little green Start button, go ahead and click that. Scroll back up to the top. Hit Reload and Refresh one last time. And then from there, you should see Restart and Stop. Then you're going to want to navigate over to your 5M and connect to your server. So from there, you should see that your loading screen is working. If you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like down below. And if you guys do wish to see more of my content in the future, a subscription always helps. I do like to hear from you guys. So if you guys do have those video requests or anything of that nature, just let me know. And I'll see you guys in the next video.